massacre, Guernica was in MoMA, and there were a lot of people who were demonstrating and using Guernica as a kind of voice piece for the anti-war movement. And a individual went up and he spray painted over Guernica, kill lies all, and got arrested. And the guerrilla uh, activist network basically uh, defended him, saying that he was trying to add another layer to the anti-war masterpiece that was Picasso's Guernica. So he didn't get um, put into prison, he got you know, let off. And he ended up being the Shah of Iran's uh, art buyer, who helped the Shah of Iran to amass a big collection of impressionist paintings and modern contemporary art. Uh, because of his contacts with the Shah of Iran and his access to shed loads of money, he got inroads into the art movement in uh, the art establishment in New York because everyone was like, who is this guy who's going around with loads of money? And this person was a guy called Tony Shafrazi, who ended up being the dealer for Keith Haring and also did a lot of dealings with um, Basquiat and you know, was one of the sort of the major players 